Hello, welcome back to Conquest of Elysium 5, the Witch playthrough. This is Todd Bog with Breaking the Stream. Today we're going to uh, continue our war against the dwarves since we finally knocked out our high cultist friend. Uh, we do have some runaway dwarf troops, as is going to happen with these little guys. So let's uh, go ahead and uh, eliminate some of these while we take control here. So, Okay, had to take a little pause there, but we're good to go. All right, so we're going to continue our mission of taking over, eliminating dwarves, doing all of that. So we got these guys we'll have to take care of at some point. Um, for you, though, at this point, you need healing anyway, so let's just take over some forest while we wait. I want to take out these dwarven ballista. Um, let's go ahead and get ourselves archers, and we'll drop the witch here. The reason we're going to drop uh, the witch here is so that we can eventually move out and take out some of these enemies once we feel confident we've got the area under control. So these guys should die to two of us pretty easily. There really isn't any crazy way we could do this otherwise, so let's just go ahead and crash. Um, yes, their numbers are dying down either because they took them out or the poison. Either way, uh, as you can see, they don't have recruits, so that is a great strategy that was brought up by um, JB, so thank you for that, from the comments. Oh, this army is not as great as it could be, but it is fantastic enough to take them out if I want to. But I think they were going to go to the swamp, wasn't that the purpose? What is your special powers? You do have them all now. Okay. So I think these guys will go ahead and crush. We're going to eventually work our way down, obviously, is the plan. But uh, we're going to need to power up a little. So we'll go ahead and move to the swamp here. Might as well get to this turtle. We can kill it. And then this army can't do anything, but you can. So let's go ahead and replenish some of these losses. I need more of those. Those things are awesome. Okay. And then we've done all the flying we can do here, so we'll just fly across the water. Could go and grab these kelp for us uh, as part of my flying, but you got to be careful you don't fall and drown. So, Battle in the deep sea should be nice and easy. There we go. Uh, battle in savannah. We both die because fire. Fire bad. Um, but that's fine. And looks like the two Gorgons were good good idea for that one, so. Alright. So overall, not bad. We did some good work. Um, do we have a slow... Oh yeah, we have the ghouls. We're going to leave the ghouls here. They can defend the iron mine that the dwarves will want to take anyways. Um, crush them. And then, uh, yeah, we'll get back to it. This army should be able to take out this army pretty easily, so we'll do that and get some magic items to power up as well. Uh, right. Let's go ahead and... Uh, I think we're going to go full here just to power up. Okay, not what I wanted. I don't need Gorgons right now, but... I mean, they are extremely useful. Flying, being able to uh, knock out all these enemy armies. As you can see, we've been doing a really good job. It's probably the only reason we've been able to keep up. But, um... They're not as cool. <laughs> that's, that's the core of it. Uh-oh. Kaney, what are you doing? Okay, so we'll take these. Let's see, you're good. Who do I have left? All right, so up here we need to transfer all my um, I call them froggies, but they're called swamp monsters. There we go. Love swimming and sleeping. Can be seen swimming in a muddy pond or just dozing in the swamp. People should be aware of approaching it, however, because like most monsters, it's aggressive and attacks humans whenever it gets a chance. Um, I wish I had a way to get her swamp move. That would be really nice. Um, so it might be something 
I have an Androphage Lord I could get. We'll do that right now. This probably wasn't the best place to put him, but... Um, what I could do is I could put him in the same army as her. So let's... We'll just meet up here. Uh, yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. I'm going to grab the Swamp Monsters, all of them, and uh, add him to the army um, under her control. And then we can use the Bog path uh, to go to the other planes and then he can take over the army she won't go with them and then uh, he can go exploring with that army so that might be the way to do it because uh, he has swamp move they have swamp move so we'll be able to move through all the multitude of swamps that we saw with very little uh, effort and it'll really pump up our fungus income so uh, let's see our best option here do need to keep working our way down, so let's just do that. All right, there's that horror ohm we were worried about before. Um, let's go this way. I don't want to fight him. If we get him in an ambush situation, that would put us close enough that uh, we might be able to see some good stuff there. So, all right, you need to get back on land. Let's see. Yeah, you guys are all pretty chill at this point. Let's just take everything under our control here. All right. Um, snag those. Pretty easy. Lost a white and two shade beasts and uh, a soulless, but we got a soulless soldier, so not bad. Very nice. Lots of archers and pikeneers, so all right. Stupid boar. These things can take care of it though, so let's uh, continue marching our way down. We're gonna take this out, is the idea. We're going to use your special powers for minor summonings. Okay. And we should probably transfer out our slow units. There we go. Hmm. Tatsu. That'll be a tough fight for this group. Because uh, of that elemental magic and the poison breath won't matter, I guess, for the ghosts. Right? Yeah, they're poison resistant. Um, and he is too. So yeah, it's just the elemental magic. Uh, we should be able to cut him down fairly quickly then. He's got two armor, but a lot of our attacks ignore armor. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, let's try it. Get us these deep sea gem deposits under our control. Uh, yep, he moved. Um, Alright. So let's take advantage of the game here. Uh, let's see if you can take out that guy. The key thing is not knowing he's there when you move. Um, the armies don't communicate, obviously, so. <laughs> Alright, we'll come down here. We'll take care of our boar friend while gathering this forest again. Uh, I don't know what that is, but I'm guessing it's some sort of void monster. Let's kill this if we can first and um, steal that from you oh Picasa you can also move huh I'll just move directly south all right so we can take control of stuff here let's do that kill those guys and then everything is dangerous here Oh, no, no, no. Transfer all. And what we're going to do is we're going to move up here. And we're going to chill. 
Next turn, we'll uh, we'll do our swamp move. This irks me. It irks me more that the troll finally attacked, and it attacked me of all things. All right, meteor struck down. All right. Darn. We were doing pretty good on it for a little bit. Um, murder them. That's not good. Uh, let's see. Ethereal and it's it can be poison though. So, huh. Uh, black cloud and decay though is bad news for us. And then it has the wave of pus. So we'll see what happens here. All right. Well, we won. That's all that matters. Uh, that was in the deserted port. Let's go ahead and drop some more archers here just to protect it. The ones that are left are going to be diseased, so they're going to slowly die. So that sucks, but that's the way it goes. And then uh, where did that meteor crash? Down here. Okay. And we can get an androphage lord. All right. That's a fairly large army. And a caster to boot, so we're not going to deal with that. Yep, let's crash. Man, that boar was doing some pretty good business there. Alright, this should be a fairly easy fight for us. Uh, you did win, but you are taking some damage. Never healing wound. Definitely do not want to throw any of my regular armies at you, though. Alright, these guys are starting to get damaged here, but uh, it's way too slow. How is she getting so many defenses up? That miasma just keeps bouncing around. It sucks. Oh well. Um, definitely don't want to use them around the miasma. So let's get them across the way here. You guys can get to this swamp and we can use some swamp summons here. Grab that. Whatever took it. Should I send a reinforcements? Yeah, why not? I don't know what we're fighting, but two of us should be a better fight for it. Uh, ooh, they got ten pike in the air there, so that changes things up. Okay. Of course. Transfer. Pyrus. All right, let's use your special powers. And you don't have it. I need the bog path. Okay. So let's move here to get away from the poison. Stupid boars. All right. Deep sea gem deposit. So what's it got? Earth meld. Not a bad thing for us. It does earth grip. Storm wind is a stun, but it's not magic. And then earth grip again. So should be no problem. So uh, let's see. Yeah, the Tatsu did nothing with its poison breath or venomous bite. So not bad at all. Um, battle in the forest. Dead boars. Dang it. What? Okay. <laughs> Alright. That actually took a little bit more than I thought it would. Uh, we did lose five Shade Beasts. Our Dire Wolf... Three spirits, a ghost warrior, and a spectral archer. So, uh, but we did get all sorts of nice things. Uh, let's see, battle in the forest. Okay, well, no, the yeah, 
17 points of damage from the freaking crossbow. One good shot. That's all it took. So, but sometimes that's all it does take. Yeah. All right, and ancient forest. Good enough. All right, we finally have control of this area. That makes me happy. Uh, let's go ahead and overrun those guys. Void hounds, not great. Um, but that's all right. Okay. Let's go kill ourselves a deep sea lobster. The waters will be clear of all enemies soon. I don't think this. I think this will be the first time I've done that on a map. Um, well, at least the the western waters. There's a lot to go, obviously. Okay, take control here. Trying to figure out our best plan of action here. All right, so. I need to be on a swamp, don't I? I'm an idiot. All right. I'm already taking damage with you, Papyrus. Or Papyrus. Uh, let's just wait here, because there's no poison there. And uh, we'll move you back, because I forgot that i got to learn the spell, or the ritual, in order to get us to the other plane. So we'll deal with it. Kill you. And you. What do you want to do? And you're chilling. And you guys are chill. Perfect. All right, battle in the market village. Ten swordsmen, beautiful. All right, uh, we should probably kill these. It'll be ethereal on ethereal. Life drain is magic, though, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. So hmm. all of our attacks are magic as well. So yeah, I don't foresee this being a huge deal for us. So let's just do that not be silly here we'll keep taking our stuff back uh, do we want to keep pushing into that probably not maybe if we get all four not a bad idea let's let's pause we'll we'll see if we can get all four and just crush that thing finally uh let's see you need to use your special powers there we go that's what we needed is bog path come up here we'll chill for a turn you guys should be able to crash into this that's a fairly sizable army all told um, what do we got thousand we've got more than enough let's go ahead and give you a ritual of mastery enchanted sleeps beautiful poison mist will probably be better than venom so we'll do that as well Oberic is Oberic. you've got mass charm Curse of Pigs might not be a bad idea. We'll leave that in, actually. Let's get rid of Curse of the Frog Prince and do Curse of Pigs instead. Because uh, Dwarves are much harder... Oh, forgot I used that ability. Uh, dwarves are much hardier than Boars. Um, little known fact. I know most of you are, are wondering what I'm talking about, right? But... Uh, Oh, did not expect to see anybody there, but that should be a nice, easy fight. We are really wounded. All right. Well, let's go ahead and die to whatever that is. And uh, let's go ahead and pop Swamp Soul. No. Summon Old One. Oh, come on. I overspent in everything. That would have been lovely to have replenish my ranks even quicker, but oh well. What can you do? Alright, we're going to chill here because uh, this could be poison next round. Just knowing our luck, it will be. So many dwarves. Okay, 
Battle in Deep Sea, Dead Lobster, Battle in the Plains. Went straight for the casters, but... Alright. So, we did lose a Dispossessed Spirit, but overall, like I thought it would happen. All our attacks, uh, so we'll hit this again. All of these attacks are magic, and since they're magic, uh, they can damage these guys without uh, any worry about Etherealness, because Etherealness only ignores non-magic attacks, so... Alright. I don't know where I was going. Uh, battle in a Swamp. Yeah, that didn't really do anything for us, unfortunately. And that was pretty easy. Okay, it was just spirits. Uh, I should probably grab that catapult. Yeah, that would be kind of useful. I don't think it'll ever come in serious numbers, but... Yeah, I'll grab the crossbows as well. Alright. We can finally crush this group. Uh, let's see. There's a lot of archers. We can leave these guys behind. Might as well have some archers, though. See what happens there. Okay, so everybody's available. So let's see if four of them can take out one of those horror ohms. Um, all right, so we're all good to go. There's no poison here. So let's go ahead and transfer you. Let's go ahead and you gotta be in a swamp to do it, huh? <laughs> let's go ahead and transfer you. Uh, it is swamp to swamp travel. It kind of makes sense, but uh, I've been wanting to show this off forever and I can't. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Um, anyways, uh, let's see here. It's all under control. I think we should push down to here with our spirit army. So that's what we'll do. You can go ahead and do a minor summoning. Your chill. Perfect. All right. Let's get here. We can kill the shark if it doesn't move. We'll grab those red corals along the way. Keeney. Um... Yeah, your job's pretty much... I want to get that Temple City under control again. As long as the Troll King has moved off of it. And then we'll go take that mine. Alright, uh, let's see. Do I keep pushing down here? No, I think we need to... Start uh, playing free safety on these dwarf productions. And I think we'll be in good shape. Steal all this stuff here. All right, um, we'll have enough because it is the beginning of fall, early fall, yep. So let's go ahead and do another big summon. Okay, worm's good. Uh, especially when we're talking about walls like these and we need to kill them. Um, that's really good. Only two spots for the poison. Sorry, I was waiting for the poison to, to ramp up here. All right, chill there. Our job is to power up. That's the intention there anyways. All right, you guys are good, you're good. Okay. Yep, definitely need to get my... Uh... Very nice, we did petrify him, so. Um... So, uh, again, I don't know if I've emphasized this enough, but when they're petrified or immobilized or stunned or anything, there's always two extra points of damage that happen due to an incapacitated target. That's why it's so deadly when you get stunned. Um, that's why Tengu are so good. Um, Tengu are great because they stun. Ooh, we got ourselves a Dwarf Commander. Um, and because of that stun, you know, it does just power up the rest of the army that is in range and can do all the things, so. Uh, let's see. Yep, time to move this army down. And no real great way to go, but we'll do that. At this point... Go ahead and grab Hoder. 
I think we want to get this new franchise before it can get started. We'll do the same in this silver mine when he sets up that franchise. All right. So, of course, you're in a poison spot already, but it's what's going to happen. All right. Now, finally, take control of you and let us use our special power to bog path. All right. Question is, do you want to go to Aslan? I think Aslan's going to be better for us. This is the primal plane. This is Aslan. So we're going to go with Aslan first. And the question is, where do we want to go? Let's go down this way. All right. So this is Aslan. And as you can see, there's just a bunch of crazy stuff. Oh, that's a bush. Let's look at the crocodiles. So buckets of crocodiles. You've got spirits. Um, so cloud folk soldiers are ethereal. And they have 11 hit points. So they're pretty, pretty sturdy. She does a winds and a pummeling winds. Um, so the winds is a burst three, just like our uh, Tengu friends. And then pummeling winds just her melee, but both can stun uh, with strength negating. So, so that's an interesting thing to start up next to. We've got a lake here, and then uh, let's see. Let's transfer you out. You almost died to that poison move. Oof. Um, but you can transfer all... Should we crush into these alligators? I think we want to wait, because you have true charm. Uh, let's see. We'll wait. We'll use our witch to attack with the alligators and such. What we can do with him is not that, apparently, because you do not have swamp move. All right. All right, well, let's take you out before I screw things up any further. But this is what I was more like or expecting to see. So this is interesting. It's on water. It's a ford. Okay, that's why. So this is traversable. Uh, but you get plume serpents, which have strong venomous bites. So good melee damage, so it's not just poison damage, which is uh, unfortunate for us. But 82 hit points and one armor, that's good. Uh, this casts serpent and sky level magic, and uh, is also a ritual caster. And then, of course, serpents. So um, that's what I was expecting to see more of, plume serpents and things like that. But um, yeah, we'll, we'll kind of explore and see what we can find there. We still have 538, so let's go ahead and use our special powers. And close. There you go. That works. Hey, is that our old friend? Let's see. It's got a map of Pandemonium if we wanted to go there. Blunt and Pierce Resistant, so that's good. Because um, essentially we, we got to survive the, the ballistas here. Do a few more summons and I feel confident. We're in the right season for it. As you can see, we're getting 580. Um, we're selling iron. At this point, I don't need gold. So why don't we go ahead and buy fungus at overpriced? We're making more than enough. Um, kill the shark just because we can. That army's moved. Okay. Uh, this army can do one thing, though. Let's go ahead and do that minor summoning. Uh, no magic item. That sucks. But Knuckle Bones is now part of the army. All right. One, two, three. You're good. You're good. And then we've got control of this area again. No more enemy spawns that I can see. So let's go so we can get this island here. And then, yeah, we'll start taking control of this area again, and we'll be in a much better position against the dwarves. They just pop out so many armies. It's silly. Battle in the deep sea. That actually hit somebody. Okay. So we did lose two of our cab, but uh, we did take them out. Got them before they became a full franchise. I.e. started building ballistas like crazy. Um, Alright, so we're in position to actually do something here. 
Um, I think we'll grab our catapult friend and we'll attack this tower. And then we'll just keep an eye out for any possible recruits. Those 20 units should not be getting past us, so we'll take care of them. Uh, first, though, let's go ahead and use your special power. Yeah, Hydra friends, welcome back. I missed you guys. Alright, we'll crush into this. This should be a nice, easy fight for us. Boom. Okay. Yeah, I thought it would be void down there, so come up here and grab this from the shallow sea. And then uh, this army here. We'll just take this for now. I'm kind of torn. I think we might be able to survive against two ballistas. And that'll save us some trouble here. Well, this army is going to be able to easily take it, so let's just be smart. Let's just go that way. And that. Alright, so now that we're leaving behind our slow friend. Ooh, cool. 31 units here. That should be an easy fight with our swamp monsters. We'll do that, but that'll also give us a village. Um... Let's see, what is your job? Your job is to do, I, I was like, there's something I want to do with him. There you go. Get some more summons going. Let's see, you also have swamp move. Still no poison resistance, unfortunately. Okay, yeah, you took back your old gold mine that you were defending before. Um, I'm not going to bother to bother buy any troops there because I'll probably lose them all if you decide to go back and stomp on us. But All right, battle in a plane. Okay. So we gained a doppel spawn. That's all that matters to me. That's what I was hoping for. So we got ourselves six crocodiles, all told, because of all that charm we've got. So powers up our army. It does slow it down a bit. But they do have swamp move, so that will speed things up a little bit for them as well. So, so all told, we uh, we still break even. Uh, all right, Gorgon, you're fully healed, and you should be able to handle this easily. So, this is our job now. Sixteen units. These guys aren't doing anything better, so we'll do that for us. And uh, you can go ahead and undo what these dwarves did. You guys will move back in. Yeah, we got ourselves quite the army here, don't we? Get rid of this. Uh, we can keep them. Ah, we'll get rid of them. Um, all right, uh, we'll chill here for a turn. All right, so we had a plan, so let's stick to it. Transfer out the catapult, or transfer in the catapult. Uh, let's see, actually, you should take the catapult. Okay. Why are you guys so wounded? Oh, you guys never heal. That's why. I forgot about that. Oh, well. Okay. So, you guys are good. We got everything we need. Um, that's the last part. There we go. New magic item. Alright. Scrofula, what are you bringing us? Crown of the Bull. Giving Berserker to somebody, huh? Can I give it to these guys? These guys don't have it. Oh, they do have a head slot. They're fully loaded. Bane. 
Interesting. Okay. Well, let's take a look here. Cloak of Displacement should probably go on another Bane. Uh, Mirage Crystals. Yeah, it's Displacement and Mirage Crystals. I can live... Um, yeah, that's fine. Uh, Cobalt Skin Boots. Cold and Poison Resistance. We'll keep it on you. Evasion. We'll keep the Golden Plate Mail. I want to keep you alive. Although if you die, it doesn't hurt us that much, but okay. Staff of Fire, yeah, you can stay on that guy. All right, let's do it. Okay, take care of this. This has boulders. Boulders are bad, but they don't heal either, so they're almost dead. Uh, boulders are poison resistant. Yeah, slash, okay, but they're not acid resistant, right? I don't have acid, though, do I? No, I have a bunch of undead attacks, though, which are magic. Um, and drain life. Okay. Um, drain life, though, doesn't work on lifeless beings, which those rocks are. Bane blades? Yeah, oh, decay. Decay would, would do it, right? Because the rocks aren't unaging. No. Okay. Well, it'll be interesting to say the least. All right, so we'll take that. Uh, Yveth, at this point, we've maintained control of our areas for the first time in a long while. Something's taking stuff up there. I guess you can be the savior here. And then here, okay. So let's transfer all. So again, those things are slowing us down, but they have swamp moves, so that's good. Um, You have worn sun magic, huh? All right. Well, okay, that's even bigger. Uh, so this is one of the locks, the lock of the south. There's four, obviously, north, south, east, and west. Um, and he gets rain level three, worn sun level two. Uh, this right here is a king of rain, so rain level three. Um, and then this one is the rain temple attendant at rain level one. Otherwise, these armies aren't that fantastic but yeah that spell casting will be more than enough to destroy us all right he moved away so take it and i guess we'll drop might as well we've got the resources drop those and then poly poly can grab up all of these guys here might as well stack them up and see what we can do and then you are just going to sentry again, but we should probably give you uh, some more archers. All right, and then with this, we'll go ahead and call it after this turn, because I am at time again. All right, nice and easy. That's nice and easy. All right, so battle in the lookout. We did lose a Mound King, but uh, all told, we did fairly well. Hoping she'd charm the the spellcaster, but oh, uh, we, oh, that's the wrong one. We did lose a swamp monster, but we did wipe out that whole stack pretty easily. So, all right, so we'll go ahead and call it here. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, subscribe, and I will catch you guys next time.